What it is, what it is, what it is, YouTube, it's your boy KV, we are back with another reaction video. Today, ha, we got Dax on it. We done had Dax a few times before, but we really haven't, we haven't dealt with Dax that much. I ain't gonna lie to you, I've ever added to Dax a lot, but I mean, if there's a specific Dax song you'd like me to react to, let me know in the comment section. But this is Houdini, his Eminem Houdini remix freestyle, this is a one take video, something that he does on his channel a lot. I've been scrolling through his channel, just, you know, peeping the scenery. I've been seeing, you know, he does these one-take videos, so, I mean, it's cool. I enjoy him. I've reacted to one before. This will be my second one-take video Dax reaction, I believe, because I did... Who did I do a few months ago? I can't remember. If you go back in my channel, you'll see the Dax reaction that I did. But, let's go and get to the video, yo. Hmm. Hold on. Boy, hey Blackie, I thought you were quitting mm. rap. Why don't you put the mm. water Malone down and answer my question? I did say that, but I didn't say when. Oh, okay, well, make sure you do this beat justice. Eminem might be watching. I bet. Yo, hey, record. Guess who's back on an Eminem beat? Did renegade dirty like just last week? I'm the definition of hard in my rap gene. Seem fitted. Yo, that first couple seconds really threw me off. I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> I was like this close from clicking off of this, bro. I was this close from clicking off. I ain't gonna lie. We started eating that watermelon and, and that tahi, whatever the hell it's called. Okay, he almost threw me off with that. He scared me for a little bit. I ain't know what, what the hell I was watching. I thought I was watching some damn, I don't know. Let's get back. 1973 back when rap started and was first created okay. America was dealing with stagnant wages the Vietnam War mass inflation and Watergate that I just caused a resignation a president Nixon everybody was shocked then a new genre came and greased the cock oh. off mainstream came and rocked every genre known country to pop hi I'm Dax the illegitimate son of mainstream rap if you ain't never heard of my music it's cause that it doesn't propagate destroy in the middle class I touch on taboo topics Ooh. That's one thing I'm noticing about Dax. He does ta touch on taboo topics and went this. That's why I can appreciate him as an artist because, like I say in a lot of my reactions, when I'm talking about a lot of these people I react to, they don't speak on the taboo topics. They don't speak on the controversial things. They kind of avoid it because they they don't want to dethrone themselves from the platform that they're on now. I feel like a lot of them think that if they say something out of whack, that they're gonna get dethroned from where they are. So they keep quiet on it. So I can respect Dax for actually speaking up, bro. If you ain't never heard of my music, it's cause that It doesn't propagate, destroy in the middle class I touch on taboo topics Like porn addiction and the dangers of constant pussy popping I've never uh. tried drugs, but to be honest I'm a very high-functioning alcoholic I'm a straight oh. Christian who's not registered to vote I got seven and a half inches down below I went to three universities and just about four And almost got kicked out cause I'm lying assholes One had a boyfriend, second wouldn't give dome Started calling me names, so I made her walk home Third was a Newman new woman's volleyball coach Who had made false claims to destroy my name Then took me to are y'all hearing this? Am I tripping or y'all hear? Bruh Bro said he went to what, the three different universities and he had to leave all because of women? He said he made one walk home. That sometimes, sometimes you gotta make her ass walk home if she acting crazy. You know what I'm saying? That's just me. You know what I'm saying? Sometimes you gotta take a hike because if somebody's as crazy and they don't belong in your, your surrounding, your setting, you should make them walk home and leave respectfully. But for you to almost lose your whole college career, because I know he's a he was a D1 basketball player, D2, something like that, it don't matter. For you to almost lose your whole career over a girl in college, bro, it's crazy work, man. But a lot of people go through that type of shit, bro. Walk home, third was a new menu, woman's volleyball coach, who had made false claims to destroy my name, then took oh. me to court, but she lost. She must have had a brain and sword, because she got a strain in order, but assaulted me. That doesn't make sense. Like, people thinking that men and women can be friends. I'm the scientific definition of a movement. No racial tension in my ascension. It's because of my skill and how I paid attention to my lifestyle and made it cost effective. I'm a Honda driving, Target shopping, panty pinching, same clothes wearing son of a gun. I don't flex for the grand, wear designer brands, and I can confidently say that I'm not a thug. I pay all my taxes, drink Starbucks like real bodies and not all that plastic. Your BBL suck when you dump your truck. How the hell do you guys even wipe your asses? I'm left hand. <laughs> it needs to be stopped. Dax is crazy. This man is insane, bro. Oh my goodness. How do you wipe your butt if you have a BBL? Please explain that. Goodness, great. And they ain't a shout out. This ain't a shout out to the BBL community. You know what I'm saying? But that's not that's a valid question. I ain't gonna lie. I haven't wondered it, 
Because I don't be thinking about that type of shit. But Dax, he, he has a question. Like, how do you do that? I think that's a valid question. So if you could come to the front and let us know in the comment section. If you do have a BB, let me, let me know how you... Mm, let, nah, I'm joking. Don't do that shit. Let's bring it back a little bit, though. Dax Spitting. I can see his... I can see why he would be Eminem or a huge Eminem fan. And he's probably super inspired by him as well. I can tell by the way he raps in the book. He's unapologetically himself. That's Eminem. Those are the two characteristics, bro. Oh, what, what is this? When you dump your truck, how the hell do you guys even Hold on. Hold on, bro. What? When was closed captioning on? My bad, y'all. Oh. I'm left-handed, unorthodox. I uppercut the game with these hooks I dropped. They're trying to put me in a box, but they can't contain. I jab right cross over to a different lane. I'm on a roll, rock the stage, just entertain and scream and vote Donald Trump the assassination. Attempt on his life in my estimation. We'll plan by a secret organization. The best in the game. Oh my god, this man is going to get canceled. He might get assassinated. Bruh said Donald Trump's assassination was planned by a secret organization. Oh my god. Now I've heard this narrative a lot. I even thought about it myself. Because everything up to that point would have to go perfectly in order for, you know, I ain't going to get into it. I'm just saying, bruh. That, that shit, it, it sounds kind of crazy. It, it's just. Ironically, it happened at the perfect time possible. That's all I'm saying. I'm not even political at this time. I'm having fun. I'm just saying it happened perfectly. Just as if, you know, Joe stepping down. For, come on. Come on. You know what I'm saying? That, that was perfectly. Pl I don't know what's going on in politics, bro. To me, it just seems like all gimmicks right now. I ain't gonna lie, bro. Am I voting? Yes, I will be voting. And everyone should vote. But what's going on in politics has been crazy. Ever since a child, bro, I feel like I've been encouraged and influence to not even talk about politics. I felt like that was the the, the the generous thing to do was to not talk about politics. Now, just to see it as a, as a main topic now, it's just it's crazy for me to see that change. But I guess that's life now. With social media, you can't keep shit out the internet, bro. You can't keep shit. Everything's public now. There's nothing private. There's no private. Oh my god, this man's speaking too many facts right now, bro. I gotta stand up, right? Let me stand up and stretch my legs for a little bit. Because man's speaking facts, dog. When somebody's speaking facts, you know, there's very small capacity for facts in social media. So I don't even know if bro's gonna get canceled. I hope he doesn't. They might even flag this reaction, but if they do, just know what happened. If I turn up missing next week, just come looking for me. No, no, the government probably got me. You know what I'm saying? They done probably swoop me up, bro. He's speaking facts. And I feel like just me agreeing to what he's saying, I'm putting my life in danger. <laughs> just because you're watching it right now, you might be in trouble too. No, I'm joking. I'm joking. It's all jokes. I'm not threatening nobody, bro. And if you enjoy the reaction so far, bro, hit the like button, subscribe button, you know what I'm saying? Like the comment, like the comment, you know what I'm saying? Do that, all right? But yeah, Dax is speaking that shit. He's speaking that shit. Can't replace a vegetable and make a dance, bring a little with feminism and rainbow flags. I'm not even into political themes. I just had a dream that maybe we're not a dick fucker, see, but rather a bougie oligarchy. And side note, I hate the movie Barbie. This family's at you, there is the Barbie. I'm starting to smell civil war. I can taste the propaganda being made. It's practically dripping through my pores. I don't even want Hold on, what was that Steve Harvey bar? Because he said he something smelled something through his nose. You know, Steve Harvey got big ass nose. I don't know if that was a bar if he was playing off that. Let's I gotta bring it back a little bit though. Garky and side note, I hate the movie Barbie. This family's at you. Where is Steve Harvey? I'm starting to smell civil oh. war. I can taste the propaganda being made. It's practically dripping through my pores. I don't even want to rap no more. So if you ask what I'm even rapping for, just know I got bored of the mainstream wave that's washed up shore that you all ride on a shitty surf. I wasn't made in China, I'm not in stores, Taiwan, I knew Korea. I screamed to bask in something else instead of robbing you of vanilla. Content that is all just fila. Mine's too deep, that's why they try to ignore me, cause I got the scoop on all their wicked lies. Hit away the. What? Hey, yo, Dax, Dax, Dax. You gotta chill out, bro. 
you really going down that path to crash out right now. They they gonna be looking for you. I know Dax is probably somewhere in the crib hiding because as soon as he dropped this music video, as soon as he dropped this YouTube video, he knew that he'd be under a lot of controversy. When you speak too much of the truth, bro, somebody gotta take you out. Just think about it. Somebody has to take you out when you're speaking too much of the truth because if you influence the public to look at what's really going on, <laughs> they gotta do without you, bro. They gotta do without you. And it's sad that it goes down like that, but that's the, that's a hundred percent of the situation. That's what goes down every day, bro. We get lied to. We get fed bullshit. You know what I'm saying? I'm trying to keep my cuss words to a minimum because I'm not trying to get yellow marked. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I'm not trying to get yellow marked. But Dax is speaking the truth, and I can appreciate this, bro. I may not listen to his music on a day to day basis, but I know every t every song that I've reacted to that he spit, bro, he, he's always spitting something with substance in it. And me, I'm at that point in life where I don't. Just listen to one type of music. I like to listen to something with substance. This is it right here. Do ignore me cause I got the scoop on all their wicked lies. Ain't no way that I'm not top five of the best rap guys in the 45. Oh. I get chicken and not Popeyes. If you say hot dog, then I know you're fried. Oh. I rise like East today cause I'm glorified in Jesus' name. Drenched in the blood, holy name. Letting me in to restore my faith. I cannot feed my brain with the last they told of the evil ways. No. For a check or just to gone to fame, no I am protected reign over everything that is in my way Will not bend, will not break, will not lead the people astray yeah. <laughs> What is the R&B song? R&B gospel? How the hell he go from spitting this grimy stuff to, to talking about Hey, <laughs> Ain't nothing wrong with it, I'm just joking around I'm just confused. I feel like we took a major turn. Not for the worst, just a major turn in the, in the, in the direction that we were going initially. He got the Tupac persona, but he could also R&B sing like Usher. <laughs> Bro, playing both fields right now, dog. <laughs> All right, y'all, bro. That's the end of my reaction, man. Let me know how y'all feel about Dax and what he's talking about in the song. Also, let me know how y'all let me know how, how y'all feel about what's going on in today's climate, man. Is it too political for you, or are you kind of like Dax, where you just you don't want to pick a side, you just want to stand in the middle because you can see faults on both sides. You know what I'm saying? Let me know if you're that person. Let me know in the comments. But more importantly, make sure to let you say what nobody will. Oh yeah, like the video, subscribe to the channel, leave a comment down below of what I should react to next. And until next time, make sure to let you say what nobody will. Y'all peace. Ancient Greece. Boop.